best player you played against? Um, probably I played, you know, with Ben Simmons and AU a lot and, you know, against him in practice and stuff. Um, I think he's probably with the, the success he's had, I think he's you know, probably the best player that I've lined it up against. Isn't Zion Williamson from the same town as Wofford? Yes. He, uh, he's, he's, uh, in Spartanburg, went to high school about five or 10 minutes from Wofford. Did Wofford recruit Zion Williamson? Oh yeah, we we recruited him hard. Um, I remember he came. I mean, rightfully so. Um, he came on a visit my sophomore year, June. I think my sophomore year, and we, uh, you know, we welcomed him and tried to, you know, pitch our our case to him. Um, you know, being so close and stuff, and you know, with a team that we were going to have. But you know, he uh, he went on to to Duke and to the bigger school. What what if he said, "Look, I'll come there, but you know, Fletcher's got to stop shooting so much." <laughs> hey, I think it'd be worth it. Man. That'd, that'd be that'd be a good trade off. You know, we get we definitely have some some uh, more drives and dunks and highlights and stuff with with him on on the team. Can you dunk? <laughs> yeah, it's like I can dunk. I, I don't I don't show it off too much in games. Wait, did I, I just can, insult I you, Fletcher, when I ask if you could dunk? <laughs> No, I, okay. I understand. Okay. Uh, you declared for the NBA draft last year, but you didn't hire an agent. What did you find out that made you come back to Wofford? Um, I think I found out just, you know, I need to to work on my, you know, passing and my defense, um, you know, making reads off of the screens, you know, two people coming to me and finding the right guy. Um, just trying to, you know, get my, my body um, more ready. I think, you know, coming back has, has definitely helped me focus more on, you know, the, the defensive end and, you know, having to guard good players. And obviously in, in the next level, you have to guard a great player every night. So I feel like just the mindset of working on my defense and focusing on that more has, has helped me this year. Any doubts about playing in the NBA? Um, no, I mean, I think it's always been, you know, a dream of mine. Um, and so, you know, I'm always going to, you know, believe in myself and, and the work that you put in. Um, you know, I think that I can still get there. For more Dan Patrick Show, tune to Audience Channel 239 on DirecTV or download the Dan Patrick Show app.